Hello everybody and welcome to the first episode of Science or Fiction. In this first part we're going to be talking about zombie ants which are controlled by fungi. In this really weird and parasitic death sentence, the fungus of Theocordyceps unilateralis transforms carpenter ants in zombies, controlling their brains. The ants inhale the fungus and it starts growing inside their bodies. At the end, the fungus reaches the brain of the ant and makes it behave very strangely. The ant starts moving drunkenly and from time to time it convulses. These type of ants build their nests in the top of the canopy and the convulsions make them fall to lower levels. Once there, the fungus makes them grip the vein of a leaf very tightly with their mandibles. Guess where fungi like to live and grow? Yes, under leaves and close to the ground, so they control ant brains to get to the ideal area and position. Once the ant is 100% attached to the leaf with death grip, and interestingly all ants fight the leaves always at noon, the fungus devours the ant's brains and entrails, converting them in sugars which they use to grow. When the ant is dead, the fungus continues growing inside but it does not eat the muscles which control the mandibles of the ant. They preserve them so they won't be detached from the leaf. And they also preserve the outer parts of the ant so microbes and other fungi don't enter. At the end, the fungus emerges from the back of the ant's head and it spreads its spores to the ground, where they wait for other unsuspecting ants to infect them when the ants venture down to search for food. And that's how the cordyceps fungi gets to spread to other locations. And this has been Science, hope you liked the first episode, leave me any comments and suggestions below and I'll see you next time, bye!